हेलो भिवर्स ओलकाम टू माई टेक अपडेट अफिसियल यूट्यूब चैनल पावर्ड बेक्नोलॉजी आर एस एस डट कम हेलो इन दिस टीटोरियल हाउ टू इन्स्टल गिट लैब कम्यूनिटी एडिशन ऑन डेबियन टेन दिस इज माई सार्वर इनफरमेशन अपारे सिसटेम डेबियन टेन सार्वर आईपी एड्रेस टेन डट सिक्सटी सिक्स हंड्रेड डट नाइन रैम फोर जि बी बाट आई रिकमेंड एट जि बी डिस्क फिफ्टी जिबी सार्विस गिटलैब कम्यूनिटी एडिशन से एक सार्वर भार्सन डेभियन टेन एंड दिस इज माई सार्वर आईपी एड्रेस एंड दें मास्ट भी सार्वर आपडेट एंड आपग्रेड इजिंग दिस कमांड नाउ इन्स्टल साम रिकॉर्ड पैकेज Select Internet Site and hit Enter. Postfix Configuration System Mail Name. This is fully FQDN. Press Enter. Yes. Now Record Package Install and Configure Done. Now Download GitLab Auto Script. The repository is set up. You can now install package. Now install GitLab CE. That means CE Community Edition. And after this operation, 2,529 MB of additional disk space will be used. Uh, I see 940 MB file for GitLab Community Edition, and it will take. Up to 12 minute for download and installation. Yes, successful installation done. This is GitLab logo. Thank you for installing GitLab. Now reconfigure GitLab CTL using this command. Done GitLab reconfigured. Now, GitLab CTL start command. All service start. Okay. Now check GitLab CTL status. GitLab CTL status is running properly. Now, reset root password for web login. Going to GitLab Rails console option production, then reset admin root password. Yes, now loading production environment Rails console. Now select user where user ID one. That means root user, admin user. And then change password. This is my root user password you can must be replace on your own password and confirm this password then save user yes now i try to log in from access server ip address and log in user name Now access web browser username root and password is my change password and login successfully. This is root administrator account. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, please submit your valuable comments. Please subscribe my channel like and share with others and don't forget press the bell icon get the first notification